What's up, everyone? Bri Bri guy here. Uh, Marcin Held versus Team Timo Pakalin. Uh, I don't know Pakalin really well. Um, let's quick look at his record. He's eight and two. He's two and three in the inside, inside the UFC. Um, this is what he's a wrestler from Finland. Um, you know, he's thirty years old. Competes in the lightweight division. I don't know. I don't know much about him. Uh, Marcin Held, though, I do know a little bit more about. Um, he fought Will Brooks for the Bellator lightweight championship and lost. Um, he was this destroyer before he coming to the UFC. Um, he was supposed to be this, you know, this next up and comer. You know, all a lot of his wins were submission victories. He was twenty two and four coming into the UFC, and then Diego Joe, and it says Damir. I don't know who Demir is, but he's lost three straight inside the UFC. I would assume if he were to lose this, this would be the end of his UFC career for now. Um, he's a young kid. He's got a bright future. Um, you know, he's tremendous, tremendous grappler. He's only 25 years old. He's from Poland. Again, Poland. Russians killing the game right now. Uh, the international scene inside the UFC is phenomenal. Um... You know, this kid's good, um, and if he were to lose this fight, like I said, it'd probably be the end of his UFC career. With that being said, I do have him winning this just simply because I know him better than I know Timo. I'm not going to pretend I do know who that guy is. Um, I got held by decision. I think Marcin, he's going to win second round. I'll give him a two-round, second-round submission. Um... I think he gets the job done. He's he, on paper. He looks like he's the better fighter. Uh, I don't know what kind of mindset he's coming into this, knowing he's lost three in a row. Um, not many people have four straight losses and keeps their keep their job inside the UFC. So we'll have to see what happens there. Um, but yeah, I got Marcin held round two sub. Bye bye guy. Thank you for watching.